lost oh, mine. <laughs> I lost it. <laughs> Bring the public hearing to order Tuesday, February 10th, 2015, 9.34 a.m. Uh, could I get a roll call, please? Commissioner Tedesco? Here. Commissioner Odoricio? Here. Commissioner Henry? Here. Commissioner Hansen? Here. Commissioner Pulowski? Here. Could everyone please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Could I get a motion to approve the agenda? So moved, Chairman. Commissioner Pulowski? Yes. Commissioner Hansen? Aye. Commissioner Odoricio? Yes. Commissioner Henry? Yes. Commissioner Tedesco? Yes. All right. Well, good morning. All the smiling faces out there, it must be at least Tuesday. Getting closer to the end of the week, right? <laughs> <laughs> We're pleased today to recognize a young lady who was chosen as the top student for her participation in the Adams County Commissioner's 8th Grade Career Expo, which took place on November 18th, 2014. Miss Taylor Schneider, would you like to come forward? Taylor attends, School. Taylor attends Mapleton School of the Expeditionary Arts and was recognized by four different employers for her, her ability to ask thoughtful, meaningful questions, and specifically for her engagement politeness, and ability to carry on good conversation. The Career Expo is intended to introduce students to professional development and career awareness before transitioning into high school. Students have the chance to begin their active career exploration and also demonstrate in practice their professional skills with employers. Additionally, through pre and post surveys, students' growth is measured in career awareness, professional development, and perceptions of education attainment. This year, 5,700 students attended the event. Taylor, that's quite the accomplishment. And I will tell you, that was a crowded place. And to stand out in that crowded place, you did extremely well. Thank and you. And I'm very, very proud of you. And on behalf of the board, congratulations. Thank you. Would you like to say some words? Uh, I'm just honored um, to be able to go to that career expo and talk to all those different companies. It was a really fun experience and I'm thankful for my school for nominating me for this. It was a really fun experience and I'd like to go to the career expo again. <laughs> well, we'd love to have you again if we can if we can make that happen, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you are the example of what we're trying to produce in Adams County. So with that, congratulations. Thank you. So what we would like to do is present you with this uh, appreciation of the plaque with the seal. And it says, this certificate is presented to Taylor Schneider, Mapleton School of Expeditionary Arts, in recognition of outstanding professional performance at the Adams County Commissioner's Career Expo 2014. Signed, Charles Chaz Tedesco, Eva J. Henry, Eric, J. Eric Hansen, Stephen J. Odoricio and Janice E. Pulowski. And in witness thereof, we have set our hands and caused the seal of this county to be affixed February 10th, 2015. So if you would like, we will all come down and we can present you with the plaque and take some photos. Thank you. Thank you. Oops. 
she moved. Let me see. Sorry, we... <laughs> <laughs> right, you have to look at her, right? Perfect. Thank you. Okay, moving on, public comment. Do we have anyone signed up for public comment? Emma Galvin had signed up to speak about the award. Absolutely. <laughs> Please step forward, state your name and address for the record. My name is Emma Galvin. I'm with the Adams County Education Consortium at 12200 Pecos Street, Westminster, Colorado. Thank you. So on behalf of the Adams County Education Consortium and the seven districts in Adams County that we represent, I just would first really like to thank the commissioners for the 11th year of your support of this event um, and enabling career exploration for all of these eighth graders like Taylor Schneider. It makes a huge difference as I'm sure you can see in just this one glowing um, gal that we have here. And Taylor Schneider, um, as we've spoken about, is, has been recognized here today because she is truly remarkable um, among her peers uh, to have stood out among the 5,000 of them. Um, and so four separate employers actually nominated Taylor as being the engaging, polite, good conversationalist, um, and really having those thoughtful, mindful questions about her future. So. Uh, while that is the intent for all of our eighth graders, there were 450 that were recognized by employers, and so she truly has um, stood out as the shining star of this event. And so we look to Taylor to continue to set high standards for herself, and we also would like to thank um, her school, the Mapleton School of Expeditionary Arts, and her director, Jody McComb, who is here with us today. So thank you all. Thank you. Do we have anyone else that would like to make public comment? We do not. Is there anyone in the audience who did not sign up for public comment that would like to make public comment at this time? Seeing none, elected officials, any comments? Commissioner Pulaski? Chairman Tedesco, uh, Taylor, <clears throat> uh, when this began, I believe I heard somebody say 11 years ago, um, this process with the the consortium in Adams County. I was mayor of Brighton. I, uh, in Brighton's 128 year history, I'm the only woman mayor. I very much believe in the empowerment of women and I expect to see you doing that role some days, okay? So just look forward to that, to seeing you there. Thank you. And I diddle. <laughs> <laughs> Any other elected comments? No. I, I will say this, that the Adams County Education Consortium does one heck of a job, and Emma, your work is greatly appreciated, and it shows, I think, that we set records every time, every year going forward. I know that we have an emphasis on this year, and it's going to be a record year again, and just thank you very much for what you do. Okay, no other elected official comments. We will do consent calendar. Do I have a motion for the consent calendar? So moved. Same. Commissioner Henry? Yes. Commissioner Hansen? Commissioner Odoricio? Yes. Commissioner Pulowski? Yes. Commissioner Tedesco? Yes. New business, county manager. Yeah, good morning. Uh, we have one item this morning, uh, is a resolution approving amendment three to an agreement between Adams County and Sierra Detention Systems Incorporated for the security system at the Adams County Detention Center. Uh, Jen is here uh, with purchasing to talk to you about. Good morning. Sierra Detention Systems installed a closed circuit television and security system more than 10 years ago in the detention center. In 2011, the Sheriff's Office compiled data to determine if entering into a time and materials agreement would become more cost effective than continuing with the present service agreement. Uh, the results showed that the, at the time 
at that time, the time and material model would have cost the county in excess of $455,000 as compared to the current $180,000 dollar maintenance agreement, and that was in 2011. In 2011, the Sheriff's Office also researched switching from Sierra detention systems to a new security system provider with a different system. This process would cost the county an additional $1.5 to $3 million based on the cost of the original system plus estimated price increases to gain the same results of continuing the current agreement with Sierra detention systems. In 2012, the BOCC approved extensions to the agreement with Sierra Detention Systems for 2012 through 2015. The, rem the remaining 2000 renewal would be at the following rate of $17,684 per month at an annual cost of $212,208. Sierra Detention is on the <clears throat> 2015 list of sole source providers approved by the BOCC on January 13th, 2015. The recommendation is that the agreement with Sierra Detention Systems be amended to extend it for one additional year at the 2015 monthly rate of $17,684 for a total of $212,208 for the full 12 months. Thank you very much. Commissioners, do we have any questions? Seeing no questions, do we have a motion? Chair, I move a resolution approving Amendment 3 to agreement between Adams County and Sierra Detention Systems, Inc. for the security systems at the Adams County Detention Center. Commissioner Henry? Yes. Commissioner Hansen? Aye. Commissioner Odoricio? Commissioner Pulowski? Yes. Commissioner Tedesco? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. County Attorney. Good morning, Commissioners. No new business, but I would ask that the Commissioners um, adjourn into executive session as time allows today, pursuant to Colorado Revised Statute 2464024B and E, for the purpose of receiving legal advice and negotiation strategy regarding potential development at DIA. Do we have a motion? So moved. Second. Commissioner Henry? Yes. Commissioner Hansen? Commissioner Odoricio? Yes. Commissioner Pulowski? Yes. Commissioner Tedesco? Yes. Commissioners, I would also ask that you adjourn into executive session as time allows today, pursuant to Colorado Revised Statute 2464024B, for the purpose of receiving legal advice regarding marijuana sales tax. Do we have a motion? So moved. Second. Commissioner Pulowski? Yes. Commissioner Henry? Yes. Commissioner Odoricio? Commissioner Hansen, Aye. Commissioner Tedesco. Yes. Seeing no further business, we are adjourned.